So I'm here with Sean, and you're at Kitronic. Yes. And you do all kinds of stuff, particularly related to microbeer. Yeah, so yeah. we do, we sort out all the accessories to do with microbeer. Yeah. Um, and we work with developing new products, new circuit boards, and things like that that yeah. will work with the microbeer. Yeah, because when the microbeer came out, it was sort of in and of itself. But yes. Yeah. over this past year, there's a lot of content sort of being built around the kit. Yeah, so we take from software and turn it into hardware, like uh, so through the circuits. And yeah, and you've designed a special kit for educational purposes. Yeah, that, the inventor's kit. Yeah. So um, in, in, in your inventor's kit, you get your prototyping plate and your microbit can dock into that. Yeah, so this is sort of a breakout board kind yeah, of. Yeah, yeah, so it breaks out all the little pins as well as yeah. the big ones. Yeah, because it, it, on the original one, there's only the three pins. Yes, so. And it comes yeah. out to 20? Yes, that, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, and then that allows you to connect to all of these. Uh, we're using jumper cables like this one, so you attach the jumper cables. Yeah. And then you can connect to circuits. Which means that I can use all the pins yeah, to do more complex yeah, stuff. Definitely, yeah, yeah. Uh, and so this is like your starter pack for yeah. the. Uh, the micro bit, um, and in your booklet, you've got 10 experiments. Yeah, um, you know, it takes you all the way through from what parts you're going to need, all yeah. of which are in the box, um, and what code is going to be on the screen, and how to, how to write that. And let explain what each bit of the code is doing, yeah, um, and then how to make the circuit on the board, yeah, um, and then what, what you should see happening and why that happens, yeah, um, and then it builds you up slowly as you go through gets gradually more complex uh, until you get to stuff like that, which is a bit more complicated, yeah. and then you've got your code in the end. So basically, you take what you usually do on the microbit, yeah. make it enabling it coming out of the microbit yeah. through the complete kit. Yeah. So what kind of stuff would we find in the kit? Okay, so you in the kit you've got motors, fans, resistors, LEDs. So we have a... A small motor. Yes. We have uh, a fan going out to yes. the motor. So LEDs, different colours, and we have potentiometer. a potentiometer yeah. and a lot of resistors and other yeah. things. Yeah. So you can sort of start out easy and yeah. through these 10 projects exactly. it, it goes into becoming more complex. Yeah. What sort of age group would you think your so kid is in the UK, yeah. uh, the microbit was given to 11 year olds yeah. plus, so any sort of around that age. Around that area. The good thing about the microbit is you can make it as simple or as complicated as you like. Yeah. So it's for a variety of ages. Yeah. But sort of somewhere between 9 and 13, yeah, that, that type of thing of would probably yeah, be, yeah. be reasonable for this, yeah. for this. And it's available currently? Yes, yeah. yes. You can buy it so, from our website, geotronic.co.uk. And uh, I guess you would find it if you go through from the microbit context as well in some kind of way if I'm sort of looking into sort of where can I go about yeah. I would I would find it yeah, from that. Yeah, 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 yes, yeah. So we handle all the, the accessories that go yeah. with, with the microbit. You also do other larger accessories I know, sort of robotic stuff yeah, as, so well, we, as well. The, uh, this is a uh, Robot Wars car that we uh, designed. Robot Wars is a big thing in the UK. Yeah, the um, TV yeah, yeah, format yeah. where robots and we got, fight out each yeah, other. We yeah, we got to kill a lot to crush one of them, yeah. um, which is pretty cool. But you can connect to this via an app on your phone with Bluetooth um, and then drive it around like a remote control car, or you can use the line following features underneath. Oh, OK. So you can either sort of remote control it, or it can be automated yeah, to exactly. do all kinds of stuff. Yeah. And it's powered by the microbit. This is powered by four AA batteries yeah. in there, um, but it is controlled by the microbit. By controlled yeah. by the yeah. microbit. So the coding, just like anything else, it's just that we build a big yes, exactly. war robot yep, instead. Exactly. Yeah, this is uh, this case has been 3D printed and laser cut just to show yeah. what sort of cases you can design for it. Thank you so much. You're it's welcome. been a pleasure looking into yeah. these things. Nice to meet you. Thank you. Thank you.